Hey guys, uh, I'm Alex, and welcome to this lesson on winter vocabulary. Uh, so I'm from Canada, I live in Canada, and right now it is winter, it's very cold. Um, I'm jealous of people from Brazil and India and, and everywhere where there's no snow right now. So um, today I'm going to teach you a little bit about winter vocabulary, since many parts of the world have winter. Um, okay, so I have some pictures, and they, they all represent things related to winter. So these, these pieces of ice that hang down, you know, from either a building, a roof, something, um, they're hard, they can hurt you, these are called icicles, icicles. So in the winter in Canada, you must watch out for falling icicles from tall buildings. Um, they can, they can hurt you. It's not, it's not cool. Okay. Um, obviously, most of you know what snow is, or the word is snow. Now, a single piece of snow, right? Each, each little piece of snow we call a snow flake. So one piece of snow, if you can call it a piece of snow, is a snowflake. Okay, so in the winter, it snows a lot. And if you look outside, you can use the verb, and you see snow falling, you can say, it's snowing. Okay, just like raining, but snowing. Now, in the winter, sometimes uh, when you have lots of snow, and it gets wet, and if it's on the street, and there are many cars driving over the snow, the snow becomes brown, and a little bit like, not really water, but very, very dirty, very messy, very sloppy. Uh, this, when snow becomes like this, like brown and wet, we call this slush. So this is slush. Okay. So we can say, if I ask you, how is, how is the weather outside? Uh, I can say, it's slushy. So slush is not good for your shoes because it, it, the water gets into your socks and it's not, it's not a positive, a good feeling. It's not a good feeling. Okay, here we have an unfortunate situation. Uh, there is a man, maybe a girl, and they're walking on the street and then suddenly, whoa, they almost fall because there's ice on the floor, right? There's ice on the street. So we can say it's icy outside. It's icy. So the sidewalk, for example, can be icy. If it's icy, that means it's slippery, because if you can fall, you can slip. So the road is slippery. Slippery. Okay, this is an adjective. Now, when we talk about temperature, uh, most of you know the word cold, right? So, and when you start from the top, you know, we have hot and everything like that, but if we start from cold, let's put cold over here. Okay, what is a little warmer than cold, but still not, not that nice? We say chilly. It's chilly. Okay. What's a little bit warmer than chilly, but still not warm, is cool. So we have cool, chilly, cold. So think about it this way. Cool, not bad. It's okay. It's cool. Chilly, okay, I need a jacket. I need a jacket. It's getting chilly. Cold, okay, it's cold. Then the worst one, we have freezing. It's freezing. Now, freezing is like this. You're shaking. It's very, very cold. It's freezing, okay? Um, okay, guys. So, if you ever visit my country, come to Canada. Be prepared. Have a winter hat, winter jacket. Be prepared. Watch for icicles. Don't go out in the snow when it snows too much, although it's pretty. 
Uh, stay away from slush. If you want your shoes to be dry, um, don't fall. <laughs> Just don't fall. That's it. Okay, guys, if you want to test your understanding of this uh, vocabulary, check out the quiz on angvid.com. Take care. Stay warm. Happy holidays, even though that's in December. Um, enjoy your winter. Take care.